Shopify is a leading online store builder for all types and sizes of e-commerce businesses. Recently, they launched an AI theme generator and other AI tools to help store owners quickly and easily create their own unique online store in minutes. So my focus today is to show you how easy it is to generate, modify, and launch your e-commerce brand with Shopify in under 10 minutes. Okay, so with that covered, let's go ahead, jump over to my computer, and launch into Shopify. Now to get started with Shopify so that you can generate your online store with AI, simply head over to your browser and type in shopify.com or feel free to click on the link in the description below this video and that's going to take you here. You'll get access to a free three day trial and access to three months of Shopify for only $1 per month. This will give you enough time to see if Shopify is the right online store builder for your business. Okay, so what you want to do is come down here, add your email address and click on start free trial. Then just answer a few questions about your business and you'll be taken inside Shopify. For the purpose of today's tutorial, I'll be using this test Shopify account. When you first arrive inside Shopify, you'll see the option to select a paid plan. I suggest you do that now to take advantage of the free trial and you'll get access to the $1 per month for three month promo. Okay, so let's jump straight into our online store and you'll see a current theme here. It will look slightly different to mine. Then navigate down the page and locate design your store in seconds. Here we want to add keywords based on the type of store that we want to generate. For example, minimalist earphone store. So depending on the type of business brand and online store that you operate, add your relevant keywords in here. This will allow Shopify to create a unique theme with personalized content. Go ahead and click on generate themes. And here we have three website themes that have been generated. Now a website theme is the overall look and design of your website. And I'll show you how to customize your theme further soon. I like the look of this theme that has been generated. Let's go ahead and click on view demo. Then let's navigate through this theme. I like the look of this. It looks sleek, modern, and I like the use of colors. We can preview what this theme looks like on mobile as well. Again, I like the look of this. I'm going to select try theme, and that's gonna add this AI generated theme to our theme library. Let's go ahead and publish this theme on our store. Click on publish. And just like that, we now have a personalized AI generated theme for our online store. Let's go ahead and view our store. And I love the look of this new theme. Now we need to customize this theme and add products. Navigate back to admin and then navigate up to products. As you can see, I have two example products I've added here. What you wanna do is navigate up to add product and then take your time to add your product details. I'm going to quickly navigate through an example product. As you can see up here, I've added a product title as well as a product description. Now I can delete this if I like and leverage AI to help me generate a description. Add keywords related to your product. As you can see, I've added keywords and features, waterproof headphones, extreme comfort, durable and stylish. Here we can change the tone. I'm going to change the tone to daring and then click on generate. And just like that, AI has generated a description for this product. We can generate again or keep this content. We can also play around with the different formatting options up here. Then down here, simply add your media. These are your product images. You can move these around if you like, and this will change the media order on your product page. Simply click here to add a new product image. Now we can also customize these images with AI. For example, I can leverage AI to replace the background and we can replace the background, simply describe the subject, describe the background you want, or you can choose from a suggested background. For example, studio, and I'm going to add the subject and hit generate. And then we have these AI generated images that we can use. We can also remove the background and add a color if we like. All right, I'm going to close this, navigate down, add the product category, add your pricing. You can also add a compare to pricing, cost per item, profit and margin, stock keeping unit if you like, then the quantity down here. Then down here, are you selling a physical product? If you're selling a digital product, what I'll do is link a tutorial up above and down below in the description, which will show you how you can sell digital products with Shopify. Then down here, you can add variants if you like. Here we have suggested categories. I'm going to select all. Then for the search engine listing, we can add a title. Simply click on edit, add the title and description. And this is going to help with the product discovery on different search engines like Google search. If we navigate back up to the top, we can choose if this product is active or a draft product, then come down and click on save. You can also navigate up to the top and duplicate a product to save time in adding other products that are similar to this existing product. Okay, let's navigate back over to online store and customize this AI generated theme. 
Hey guys, just quickly, did you know that over 90% of you that enjoy our free educational content have not yet subscribed? It would mean a lot to me if you drop a comment or hit subscribe if you love what I'm creating. This helps us grow the channel and motivates me to create bigger and more impactful tutorials for you to consume for free. Okay, so with that happy note, thank you in advance, and let's get back to the video. Simply navigate through all your different pages. You can navigate up here and click on the page that you want to customize or other pages if you've created other pages. I'm going to customize the home page. We have the announcement bar. We can make changes here, for example, and then you can add a link to a product page like this product that we just added. I'm going to head back and I can do the same for this banner here. Let's navigate back. Then under template, we can make changes to this content. Simply click on the element, this slideshow here, and this image in particular, we can change this content as well as this content here. Again, we can leverage AI to help us generate content for each of our text sections. I'm going to rephrase this and I'm going to use this AI generated description here. Then we can change the button label shop now. You can see that here. That's going to send website visitors to all our products. And then there's other changes we can make. Here's the color scheme we're currently using. These are our default color schemes that we can customize if we like by navigating over to theme settings. However, based on this AI generated theme that we created, these were the color themes that were added. So I'm happy with these. Once you make any changes, navigate up to save and then preview your changes across devices. Again, I can change this image if I like. Let's navigate back and then down the page, we have collections, featured collections. I want to just show two. And again, all I need to do is fill out these details. I can add a header if I like, a description, but again, I'm happy with this default section. Navigate back. Here we have a multi-column. You can see that here. I'm going to navigate back. And then we have these two blocks inside the multi-column. We have sleek sound, this section here. We can simply make changes, change the image, heading, description, and we can link shop all down here to all our products, for example, all products. And I could do the same with this block over here. Now you can also click on each of these different sections and then make changes on the left-hand side. It's as simple as that. Again, once you make any changes, simply click on save. Now to add additional pages up here, simply navigate back and exit out of the theme builder, then navigate over to pages and simply click on add page to add additional pages. Then what you want to do is navigate over to content and look for menus. And here you have a main menu as well as a footer menu to customize. For example, the primary menu, click here and then add a menu item. You can also rearrange the different menu items. I'm going to head back and then navigate down to blog posts. Here we can create blogs for SEO. Now, if you're interested in learning more about Shopify SEO and creating blog content, what I'll do is link the appropriate tutorials up above and down below in the description for you to check out. Let's navigate back over to home and then locate the sidekick icon on the right hand side. Here you can leverage this AI tool called Sidekick to help you get the most out of Shopify. For example, you can navigate down here and ask what are the best ways to advertise headphones on Shopify. Let's see what Sidekick generates. Here are some effective ways to advertise headphones on your store. And we can take these suggestions into consideration. Now, before you're ready to start selling your products on Shopify, we need to navigate over to settings quickly and then make sure that your store details are correct. Then navigate over to payments. Here, it's important to activate Shopify payments if you have access to Shopify payments in your country, as well as PayPal if you're targeting countries like the US. Let's close out a Sidekick. And you can also add other payment methods. However, my recommendation is you get started with Shopify payments and PayPal. Depending on the country that you operate from, you'll also see other payment options. And it only takes a few clicks to set up your payment options. The more payment options you enable, the easier it is for your customers to purchase your products. Then you also want to navigate over to shipping and delivery. And here you want to set up your shipping details. Where do your products ship to? What countries can you sell to? Or do you sell globally because you sell a digital product? Take your time to navigate through and add your shipping and delivery details. Then you also want to navigate down to domains. And here you can choose to use a free Shopify, myshopify.com domain name, or you can connect a professional domain name like this. Again, if you're interested in connecting a professional custom domain, as well as use and set up a professional business email, I will add the relevant tutorial up above and down below in the description for you to check out. Okay, let's close out of this and then navigate back over to online store. Now, in order to publish your website live online, you'll see the option over here to remove your password. This removes the access layer from your website and allows website visitors to visit your store and make a purchase. 
However, that is it for this brief tutorial, walking you through how to quickly generate an online store with Shopify using AI, and then how you can quickly customize and then launch your online store. Now, if you enjoyed this brief Shopify tutorial, what I'll do is add a comprehensive tutorial down below in the description. I'll also link it up above that will break down further each of the details that I covered in this tutorial. It is an hour long, but it does dive deeper into everything you need to know about creating and launching a Shopify store. I'll also add other relevant tutorials down below in the description to help you get the most out of Shopify in terms of how to increase your conversion rates, different channels that you can leverage, as well as how you can engage in email marketing and more. And there we have it guys, that is it for this Shopify AI tutorial for beginners, showing you how you can generate a Shopify store for your e-commerce brand in under 10 minutes. Now, if you have any questions about this tutorial, make sure to pop them down below. And with that said, thank you so much for watching this video all the way through to the end. If you got value, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to this channel. And that way I'll see you in the next video. Take care everyone.